I'm Clinton Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. USDA says foreign-owned farmland in the U.S. grew by more than 8% last year. The number owned by foreign entities totaling 43.4 million acres of forest and farmland. However, that is just 3.4% of total U.S. ag land. Now on this map, the states in orange are where foreign held ag land is 2.4% or more. Canada remains the largest foreign investor of U.S. land, accounting for 32% of the total foreign held land. China accounts for less than 1%. Take a look at what border agents in Southern California intercepted last week. The shipment had been declared as jalapeno paste, which a tractor trailer they stopped was actually carrying, but a canine found something else along with it. More than 3,000 pounds of meth and more than 500 pounds of cocaine. The 28-year-old driver was detained. And Chick-fil-A is closed on Sunday. It's a practice that's been in place since it first opened in Georgia back in 1946. But now a bill has been introduced in New York that could affect Chick-fil-A locations at rest stops along Interstate 90 in the state. The new bill would require food services at transportation facilities and rest areas owned and operated by certain public authorities to remain open seven days a week. So far, no comment from Chick-fil-A. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on the station or anytime at agweb.com.